Hello AP Gov students. Okay, so today I'm going to show you how you can um, manipulate your results to show how many hits there are on your topic. Um, so we're going to be using two tools. One is Google News and the other one is our World News Digest. Okay, so first of all, I'm going to show you World News Digest. Here I am at your LibGuide. You can see it right up here humefoghs.libguides.com slash govt and for this situation I'm actually going to be using World News Digest okay so go ahead and click on that it gives you the username and password okay so I'm going to type that in humefog and student let's hope I typed it right that'd be pretty embarrassing if I didn't okay so here I am here so you notice here, so I only need results from the past year. So how can I manipulate this to give that to me? Um, well, I'm going to click it to sort the option by story day. And do you see how it has the optional date range? Well, I'm going to go back a year. So I'm going to say October 29th, 2011. And then I'm going to do that same thing. October 29th, 2012. I'm going to put in my topic. So let's say I'm looking for gay marriage. That's my topic. But whatever it is, um, you do want to search for that. I recommend using quotation marks because if you have a phrase that you want to search together, because remember with those quotation marks, it's going to search for that exact phrase. Okay, so now I'm going to hit go. And um, you notice here what I got. I have. 263 breaking news. Now, what's important on that is that these are main articles that have been uh, kind of um, published kind of worldwide. So these are big news articles that were probably published in several different newspapers. So I can say, hey, there was 263 um, articles published in the past year, and I can even click on that and look at them. Uh, on this topic. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to do is what's another way to look at it, and this is going to give us some big numbers, is using Google News. So to do that, I'm going to go to Google. So you see me typing it in right there. Okay, um, so Google News, pretty cool. You're going to go up here and you're actually going to, um, it's probably going to show up on your left hand side. It doesn't show up on mine, so I'm going to go down here and click on News. But it, like I said, it's probably on your last, uh, on your left-hand side. So what I'm going to do, and there's several ways you can do this. It depends on what your, um, on what your subscription looks like. Um, uh, so, um, okay, go back to Google now. Sorry about that. Okay, so going back to Google News. Sorry, I had to log out there. Um, is I'm going to uh, type in my topic and then I'm going to do some modifications. Now you may be able to do that from your home screen. Depends on what that looks like. But um, I'm going to type in gay marriage. Once again, I type it in in my quotation marks. Now, you notice here when I type that in, it has, has 126,000 results, but that's not what I want. I need to just get it from the past year. So I'm going to go down here and I'm going to click on custom range, okay? And so it says from. So I want, um, so I don't want it like that. I want 2012. There we go. So I'm going to start on, on the 29th of 2011 and the 29th of 2012 and then I'm going to search that way and so you see that my numbers went down so in the past year there's been there's a hundred and thirty thousand results okay where they're talking about gay marriage um, in a newspaper and so the reason why this is the number is so large is because all those articles that we saw when we use issues and controversies the World News Digest um, are showing up basically the same article is showing up multiple 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 times okay so that's kind of the reason why that is uh, showing up like that
okay? And here's how I can verify that I did it correctly. So um, that's it. If you have any questions, please contact me at amanda.smithfield at mnps.org or 900-0432. That's 900-0-H-F-A. See you later.